Yo, how's it going everybody? Welcome back to my Ratchet Click Let's Play. If you enjoyed the video, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Let's get right back into the game. Alright, let's check out if they have any new guns for us. They do. Don't have the money for it though. Unfortunate. Alright. Let's just get started with this. I always thought this uh, plan was pretty cool. Alright. Down the elevator. Okay, I was gonna say, I'm, I'm assuming we're gonna be using this, this uh, planet, since we just got it. Use it to move uh, water around. Don't know why we did it here, but. Actually, don't think we want to do it here. Eh, maybe. I don't know. Might need it for like a, the next like area. And I was right. Let's go. All right, I'm not going to go down there and collect all the bolts. Maybe if there are boxes, but since there's not, I'm not going to worry about it. Go, go, go. Get out of here, you stupid vents. Alright, there's a way to the right right there. So I guess we'll just head straight into there. Uh, I'm gonna look at the map real quick. Did I miss something? No. That has to be like once you go around this corner, right? Yeah. It has to be. Um. Did I not want to take this water? I guess that's the reason why they give you a way to go back up. All right. Go, go, go. Don't try. I guess you had to because you had to break this uh, gate open. I guess it makes sense. Just go around destroying everything. And then go the other way around and collect everything. Oh, water side. Let's go. I love this music. Okay, I kind of remember this area now. Go, go, go! Race the water! Oh, don't want to waste too much time hitting like that. Get away from me! Uh oh. Water's catching up. Go, go, go! Get there before the water gets me! Oh. Don't tell me I'm too slow. Get out of here. Bro, I might be too slow. Next time I, if I do die, at least I need to just run past those enemies probably. Yeah. Either I'm not going to make this. Yeah, dude, it was right there. Are you kidding me? That sucks. Ooh, go. I'm doing much better on time this time. I've been doing the R1 uh, jump thing for anywhere that I can. Any like straightaway area. Go, go, go. Still kind of close though. But we made it. Let's go. All right, is this where that first one was? Yes, it is. Okay. If you're wondering, I was doing this 
like the jump forward thing, not the high jump. Hey, hey, hey! Press conference is over. Captain Quark don't want no more reporters bugging him in his trailer. Oh, you see, my friend and I need to speak to the captain about a matter of galactic security. You mean you and your walking camera? You paparazzi make me sick. Now beat it! But, sir, I'm sure the Captain Quark won't understand once we... Now, now, save it. I know how it works. You convince me to let you in, you snap a picture of the Captain in his underpants, underpants. then you sell a picture to the info tabloid for a million volts! You've got it all wrong! Meanwhile, I'm stuck here making six volts an hour, and I have to listen to a lecture from that cheapskate Quark. So you don't get in unless I get a kickback. In advance. Yo, this man's getting ripped off for six bolts an hour. Can run around the map and get that in a, not even an hour. You see how it works. You grease the hinges, the door opens. Captain Quark. What's that? It's Ratchet and Clank, Captain. You know, from the hub. Oh, yes, yes, I know who you are. You do? Yes, and thank the galaxy you found me. Huh? There's an awful plot being hatched to destroy our planets. Ratchet, he knows. Great. Does that mean we can go hoverboarding now? My friends, we're all in grave danger. And I believe that together, we can put a stop to this madness. Together? You mean you want our help? Look, Ratchet, I've been keeping an eye on you. And I've never seen anyone with such raw talent. You are a true hero in the making. Really? You mean... I could be famous? Oh, absolutely. Oh, here, take this. What makes one man toil in obscurity while another becomes a hero? Is it strength, compassion, determination, or just pure blind luck? Wise men through the ages have struggled with that very question. But Captain Quark knows the secret. That's why he's been able to defeat more despots, rescue more damsels in distress, and save more civilizations than any other hero in the galaxy. Now is your opportunity to see if you've got the stuff heroes are made of. This infobot contains coordinates to Quark's secret base. Can you quickly conquer Quark's killer cannonade of confounded contraption? Can you quickly quark? Can can you quarkly quit? Oh, just make your way through the defenses to the center of the base. Prove yourself, learn the secret, and earn your place in galactic history. Consult your doctor before attempting any strenuous exercise. Not responsible for death or dismemberment. Your results may vary. Meet me at, uh, uh, meet me at my headquarters. Hey, Captain Ratchet, what do you think? We won't fail you, sir. We promise. All right, on to the next thing, which is probably just right behind this, right? Oh, God. All right, well, oh, maybe not. How do I get there? Oh, probably that way from the start, yeah. Which kind of sucks because I could easily just squeeze through one of those bars. This might be one of the areas that there's like a glitch or like speed running. I could be wrong, but I've only seen like a speedrun of this game like a couple times, so I'm not too sure. I know there's one in that area, or like, I think it's that area. Unless I'm thinking of going commando again. I don't know. I always mix these games up. <laughs> Let me off. All right. I should have bought more ammo. I don't know. I'm going to. Whoops. At least I got one of those off. See, that's why I'd rather the equipment and stuff not be one of the selectable things and just be like an automatic thing. Because like right there, I 100% thought I had a weapon out when I didn't. That's also just me being stupid too though. <laughs> I see the fishy. Yeah. Another cool thing is that I think it's this game, but the fish in here are the same as the lurker in Jack and Dexter. I don't know if that's this game or not, though. 
Do you know the same or just like different colors, but like the same type of fish or something? I don't remember exactly. But they used to creep me out when I was younger. Oh, he splits. Alright, just so you don't have to waste time and wait for it to blow up. Oh god. I, for some reason, I thought that was going to come up way faster than it did. That made him deliver the bolt straight to me. Alright, before I open any doors, I'm just gonna take care of this guy. Alright, easy enough. Those guys aren't too bad. Lots of people. Oh god. I thought I was gonna be able to shoot that a lot faster. Alright. Also, for this game, I think there's a tro- there has to be like a trophy for like collecting a certain amount of bolts. And most of the time you're not gonna do that in one playthrough or anything like that. So... I believe... If this is the, um, yeah, hoverboard race, you're, you, there's a way to like glitch onto the hoverboard track and be able to like destroy the same boxes like over and over again. And I believe a lot of people will like, what was it? I forget what it was. I think they do something to where they're, they make their controller automatically like shoot the boxes or something like that. Get him. Let's go. Those things are a lot weaker than they look. And I believe this is like one of the places. Or, or at least where you unlock it. Is it in here? Hi there, fuzzball. Uh, maybe you buy it for someone. You get like the Rhino, I think it's called. Which is like one of the best guns in the game. Or not one of it. It is the best gun in the game. But it cost a lot of money, I believe. All right, and then we, I think it's from this guy. I forget what his name is, but I think we met him on the other uh, planet. All right, and let's talk to you. Well, okay, Ratchet. I'm kidding. Sorry, he's not for sale. What's a rhino anyway? Rip you a new one. What did you just say to me? R Y N O. Rip you a new one. Why, that's the most powerful missile launcher in the galaxy. I know it's worth a lot of bolts. He must have stolen it from the Blarg. Stolen? Book trash can. Did I say anything about it being hot? You better watch your mouth or I'll. Wait, don't tell me. Rip you a new one. Okay, it's not the same guy. I thought he kind of looks like the racer guy. But yeah, as you can see, it's a lot of bolts that we clearly do not have right now. So we'll have to come back to that probably at the very end of the game. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What the heck? Those did not go where I wanted it to. Yeah, okay. Quite a bit before we're at the race. Yeah, it kind of sucks. You get that, like, when you're done with the game already. I guess, like, you can bring it into, like, New Game Plus. I'm pretty sure this, it, I'm pretty sure this game has that. But I don't think we will be doing that. Because I don't think this game has gun levels either. 
Yeah, no, I think they added that in for the second one. So I'm pretty sure in this game there's really no reason to do New Game Plus unless you just want to play it again. Oh no, get away. Get away from me. Okay, cool. Wasn't too bad. Uh, I believe that's the way we're supposed to go. Let me just collect this real quick. So we can get our full health back. And get some more bolts since clearly we need it. If we ever want to get the rhino. Oh uh, yeah, I remember this. It's like a little grid. Once again, I think there's a, uh, a gold bolt thing somewhere in here. I almost just killed myself. Or at least for myself. Oh yeah, gold bolt right there. Once again, we won't be getting any of those until uh, I complete the game. Get away from me! Kind of unfortunate that you didn't get bolts from these guys, though. Alright, almost there, and we are out. So, you take this path to get there, but we're gonna wait. Wait for me! Ow. Still got him, though. <laughs> I was able to get one off. There we go. Yeah, it's kind of unfortunate though that those things aren't like, you know, tanky. <laughs> They're not tanky for being a tank. I think they take a lot of, uh, like, blaster hits though. Could also just be talking to my butt though, I don't actually remember. Okay, this area for sure, I'm pretty sure has like, a, uh, glitch for speedrunning. I'm just gonna collect all these before we talk to her though. Cause I'm pretty sure this is like where the uh, races are. Whoops. Let's just unlock this for convenience later. Boom. And now we can talk to her. Welcome to the Hovercon Intergalactic Hoverboard Competition. Captain Quark's giving away a brand new Platinum Zoomerator to the winner of this competition. A Platinum Zoomerator? Perhaps that will be the proof of your accomplishments that Skid's agent requires. Wait, do you guys mean Skid McMarks? Yeah, Skid couldn't make it, so we're here to, you know, fill in for him. Guess we'll see about that.
folks, Captain Quark here. It is my distinct pleasure to introduce this year's Hovercon Intergalactic Champions. Let's give it up for newcomers. Ratchet and Clank. Hey, look, that's us. Today's winners will take home a brand new professional grade Model T-15 Platinum Zoomerator. Manufactured by Gadgetron, this hoverboard drive delivers more lift, speed, and maneuverability than any other anti-grab device on the market. Well, folks, that's all the time we have tonight. Remember to set your info bots to the Quark Classic channel for tonight's episode of Dogfight Over Death Canyon, starring yours truly. Thank you, and have a Quartastic day. Let's go. I might have been muted there. I don't actually know, because I hit the mute button right after, and the show I was unmuted, so I'm not too sure. Um, we might try to go back to that one planet before I end this episode. To show that we won the hover race or whatever. So we'll see. Hopefully it doesn't take too long. Let me off. It sucks you have to wait for it to like completely stop before you can hop off. All right, which one was it? Not that one, not that one. It was this one, I believe. Yeah, okay. We're gonna head off here real quick. We could just take this teleporter back to him, right? I guess that's not a teleporter, but a little capsule travel thing. Hey, buddy. Fantastic! You got it! Great work, kid. So, are you gonna represent me? You bet, kid. And as a signing bonus, I've got this. Cool helmet! That is a sonic summoner. It is used to attract sand mice. Right, and it's all yours! <laughs> well, I'm off to finalize the paperwork. <laughs> I'll have my people call your people. Do you have people? The sonic summoner allows you to interact with the mysterious and intelligent sand mice species. Despite their innocent appearance, sand mice are very effective and aggressive hunters. Simply equip the Sonic Summoner when you are near a sand mouse house and a mouse will emerge to greet you. If the mouse likes you, it may offer a bit of high caliber tactical assistance. All right. I feel like I've never used this before. <laughs> Unless you have to somewhere in the game, but I, I, I don't ever remember using this. So I guess it might not really be necessary to come get it, but 100% we did. But anyways, I'll do it for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.